die, that is. I'll be going on ahead. What the heck? Hmm, so is this now tutorial mode? Probably. Well, hello again, everyone. My name is Chronos006, back with another episode of Ultra Despair Girls. Ooh, there we go. When we last left off, I thought it was going to save automatically, but it didn't. Time for another tutorial. Looks like you have obtained Move. Move is a truth bullet that can activate some machines with super-powered hacking, super hacking magic. Try it on that power panel with the red light. Oh, and I know you probably remember, but you could press the X button to change ammo. Thanks. <laughs> what happens if I do break? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> In a different kind of game world, that would have destroyed it and I'd be dead. And of course, she says the word. But I'm scared. Oh, there really is no save point in here. This game makes you go a long time before you can get to a save point. I am reminded of Doom a little bit. Time for another tutorial. Now that you put in some time with the hacking gun, let me tell you something. The red left eye is a weak point. Okay, I didn't know that. Shoot that weak point with break and most Monokumas go down in one shot. Plus, after you hit a weak spot, break ammo will give you one power shot. It's one hell of a shot, one that's way stronger than the regular break. Now that's killing two birds with one stone. <laughs> I love the style of these games and the sense of humor. If you think you're so hot, why not try aiming for the weak point? Will do. Ooh, I only have a certain amount. There I didn't notice again. that. Oh, he's covering it. Unfair. See, he's covering it. Gotcha, fucker. Ha <laughs> ha. It's weaker. Ah, I get a coin. Okay. That's probably how I upgrade. I'm guessing. Other that, other than that, I may just get those stupid little trinkets. But we'll see. Do 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 do. Comb your hair there. <laughs> Some tactical espionage action here. <laughs> he's either looking for something or he's dabbing. Is this the right way? I'm guessing not. Just a hunch. Okay, are you gonna turn when I get close? No. Goodbye. The music in this game is so weird. From the uh <laughs> to this. Oh, oh, oh. Did I just get locked in? Uh that's a problem. Uh, someone's sneaking up on me. I can't see! Yeesh. Oh shit, I missed. Mm -hmm. Not good. Ah! God, this camera! Screw this camera. Okay, I'm just hitting him. I didn't kill him? A point blank shot didn't kill him. Okay. Boy, you can handle those corners well. Don't do that. What are you doing? I hit him in the red eye! Come on. Okay, so if I do. If I hit him in the eye, I get a gold. If I kill him, it seems like I get a bronze. Interesting. Oh, 
Oh, God. It's the crazy kids. You, you're those kids. The kids who were on TV. Oh, man. I'm famous. The kids aren't all right. I'd autograph your back anytime. <laughs> I can only write using a chisel, but if you don't mind that, I can sign your back too. We accept presents as well. I'm always in the mood for sweets. However, salty flavors are no good. Those disgusting tastes are never worth putting in your mouth. Sweets? Mm, I want to drive a train someday. Okay, you are creepy. Yeah, I want to go inside a chimney. Professor X? Welcome, big sis. I'm so happy you came, Meow. Do you have any idea how fast you were going, Meow? Um... Uh... Oh, that's right. Big sis doesn't know us yet. Well, I guess we should start with introductions. All right, let's start with me, the leader. I guess I'm supposed to hit X. I'm the super duper leader that unites the warriors of hope with a bang. Masaru Daimon! So kawaii. My special subject was P.E., so they call me Lil Ultimate P.E. I'm the P.E. king who can do every exercise ever. Running non-stop 24-7, 365 is easy as pie. Oh, I almost forgot. My job in the Warriors of Hope is the hero. I happen to be a hero. And as hero and the leader, I'm going to be the new ruler of this town. These games have such a style to them. You really have to like it. I'm the leader of the Warriors of Hope. Hero class, Masaru Daimon. Yeah, you, you, you just told me that. I always give 100%. My favorite class was gym, so they called me Lil Ultimate P.E. Aha! A hero, the leader, and the Lil Ultimate P.E. I even impress myself. I'm sure you do. You're far too boastful to be a leader. A true leader is calm and dignified. I like you already. But I am the leader. We all agreed on it. <laughs> no, I'm the leader. We all agreed on it. All he did was win rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm still the leader. I won, so I'm the leader. The leader! Fine, fine. You're the leader. Now, allow me to introduce myself. I definitely know that voice. I am the sage, Nagisa Shingetsu. I am the vice leader of- That's Cork! That's the voice of Cork from uh, Virtue's Last Reward. <laughs> My name is Nagisa Shingetsu. In the Warriors of Hope, I act as the vice leader and sage. When I attended elementary school, I was known as Little Ultimate Social Studies. Little Ultimate Social Studies. <laughs> Look at the guy just to the upper right of uh, the dude. He's like, oh no, I'm gonna lose. <laughs> of course, social studies is but one area of my expertise. I excel at all scholarly pursuits. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I, w I was this dude. I was this kid in uh, college. <laughs> I was labeled Little Ultimate Social Studies because I was raised to be among society's elite. Not that, but the fact that he's good at scholarly pursuits. And I suppose I am a babysitter of sorts for the Warriors of Hope. Monica excluded. Okay, so I guess that means he's the oldest. He's gotta be what, 11? During my time at Hope's Peak Elementary, I was known as Little Ultimate Social Studies. Of course, there was a Hope's Peak Elementary. Huh? Hope's Peak? You mean... that Hope's Peak? 
So apparently you're telling me that Hope's Peak Elementary decided to stage a little bit of a coup themselves. Mm -hmm. Why should that surprise you? I, I I didn't know there was an elementary school affiliated with the academy. Neither did I. <laughs> Such an ignorant woman. Anyway, who's next? Perhaps Jotaro? Uh, wait. Before I go, can I practice introducing myself? That's also Quirk. Uh, don't know if I sympathize or am terrified. Um. You know how when you stare into moving bicycle spokes, you get all scared? No. I'm scared now. Like, for some reason, you imagine how painful it would be to put your hand in. Oh, um, my name is Jachiro Kamuri, and bird skin isn't yummy no matter how you cook it. What the fuck is this game? I'm really good at arts and crafts, so they called me a little ultimate art. Seriously, what the fuck is this game? If it's arts and crafts, leave it to me. I cover them with nails and varnish and things. It was the and things part of his resume that helped him excel in the working field. I do the priest thing for the Warriors of Hope. Oh, and also, I wonder if aliens exist. And you specialize in arts and crafts, making you little ultimate art, correct? Moving on. Oh, you said what I was gonna say. The whole thing. So these are our bosses in this game, I'm guessing. Oh, my chest itches. I wish I could scratch it raw. Reach inside and scrape my nails on it. Hmm. Psychomantis as a kid? Also, he has eggs for eyes. Sunny side up. Your speeches are always too long. And you walk stupidly. It's like how an elephant's nose is so long. But then again, giraffe necks are long too. And also waiting for a plane takes too long, and spring break is too long. Spring break is never too long. Shut your face. Uh, um... Well, anyway, don't worry about Jotaro. He's a latchkey kid. It made him a bit mental. Latchkey kid being does not make you that mental. It's not that I dislike latchkey kids, though. Some kids say they have magical powers. They do not have magical powers. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? You might get caught inside a magical parallel universe. God, they have to give a shot of the underwear, oh, don't they? Sorry for the late introduction. My name's Katoko Utsugi, and I play the role of fighter. My name is Katoko Utsugi, and I play the fighter in the Warriors of Hope. You might think the fighter would be a boy, but nope, I'm totally a girl. I love girly things and peeled chestnuts. If it's totally adorbs, I love it. And I was pampered as a little ultimate girl in elementary school. What is this? This game is so ridiculous. But who cares about that old stuff? I'm so happy to meet you. This game is utterly freaking ridiculous. I was called Little Ultimate Drama, but that was a long time ago, so I'll leave that part out. My favorite food is peeled chestnuts. I have never had a chestnut. Not a roasted one, nor a peeled one. My least favorite food is unpeeled chestnuts. <laughs> Aren't you surprised? They're both chestnuts! Uh... And hey, did you know? Kangaroos can jump backwards. I did not know that. 
I learned something today. And, and, and believe it or not, snakes have ears. Ew! What? Okay, I gotta look that up later. Yes, yes, that's all very nice. Our next introduction is Monica. Okies. Oh, wow. Okay. Monica is a mage. Monica is called Monica. Monica's a mage in the Warriors of Hope. Never a good sign when they talk about themselves in the third person. I was known as Little Ultimate Homeroom while I was in elementary school. Why? Okay, so why are they actually showing people instead of the blocky characters? There's got to be a meaning to that. There has to be a meaning to that. You might think there are no ultimates and commons in a class like Homeroom, but there are. For me, my skill isn't really about uniting people. It's about getting them all to help me. Believe it or not, I bring together a lot of wonderful people. So you're the ultimate pity. It would be nice if you could be a wonderful person for Monica, too. And when I attended elementary school, I was called the Lil Ultimate Homeroom. I'm sure you're familiar with it, right? Homeroom? Monica just loves homeroom! The first hour of the day when we can share our thoughts. And that is why, even in the Warriors of Hope, I'm the life of the party! Why do you have a picture of a hip bone and a coccyx on the back of your dress? Not really, other than that creepy broadcast. Mm -hmm. The Warriors of Hope are heroes who save the world from demons. Isn't that amazing? We're a party of heroes that hunt down demons. But nobody really wants me in the group. Oh, poor Jotaro. And I'm the party leader, which makes me the number one king of this town. You look like the dude from Danganronpa. You... you kids are just joking, right? With demons and kings. Wasn't that a recent movie? Joking around? I mean, you guys are just kids, right? For a bunch of kids to be doing this kind of stuff. I love the subtle bits of uh, the game's music. That's really cool. Rumble! <laughs> huh? Well done, Kamaro. You've pissed him off. Aw, that's the only thing I can say. Just aw. Since you're an about to be, we were thinking, well, doesn't matter. You're clearly a demon. About to. Oh! So you think all adults are demons? Okay, that's 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 cool. That's that's very cool. Adults, children, the power structure remains the same. The subjects have merely been switched. So like I said, it's um oh god. What was that book called? Lord of the Flies. Lord of the Flies. With our monokumas, you'll be nothing more than a squashed bug beneath our feet. Further proof that Apparently in Japan, and a lot of places, people are terrified of children, number one, and number two, children in general, if given power, are terrifying because children are rather evil in many ways. Splattered like the sound of bloody chopped meat. <laughs> Intestines falling out of you like sausages. <laughs>